Top story right here tonight at six. Well, it has been a stunning sight right here in downtown Louisville for most of the day. A car that slammed into the downtown Marriott Hotel right across from the KFC Yum Center at about two this morning. Stuck in the hotel for more than 14 hours today. The car was just pulled out of the hotel and towed away around 430 PM. And there it goes. According to police, it was an overnight police chase that started in Southern Indiana with Clarksville police in pursuit and ended up at the Courtyard Marriott on Main Street right across from the KFC Yum Center. You can see the damage, the wall caving in, the front of that car smashed in on itself. We've learned that Kia was reported stolen out of Jeffersonville and right here video of the two juveniles in the car were detained by police before they were taken to the hospital. Right now, WHS 11's Jim Stratman and photojournalist Alyssa Newton are at the scene where they've been all day. And Jim, once they got that car out of there, they scrambled really to get that glass replaced behind you. Uh, what are the uh, hotel guests telling you about what they've been seeing all day? Well, Doug, we have talked to so many people throughout the day, and a lot of them really couldn't believe what they saw. You can tell behind me that crews worked very quickly in the last couple of hours to get that car out of here and then get that temporary structure up and replace some of that glass. But when we talked to people, some thought that this was a movie set. There was just a lot of disbelief from people here on the street and even people who were just floors above where I'm standing when that crash happened. Kind of figured it was like a big trash can hitting the ground or something. We saw his car just in the side of that building. I mean, it looks like something out of a movie set. <laughs> the armed robbery license plate. I don't know. I didn't see that coming. Passerbys and hotel guests have been wondering about the car sticking out of the Courtyard Marriott Hotel. Police say two juveniles crashed this stolen car after leading police on a chase from Indiana. That crash woke Lori Gibson up. Jumped out of bed. What was that? What was that? Gibson is on the third leg of her trip to see Kane Brown in concert. Yesterday, she visited Louisville's bourbon scene. And last night, she had a firsthand look at a different scene entirely. It was just a giant bang and I don't know. It felt like, kind of felt like the airplanes going off, but it was a giant bang and it felt like it was right here. And then we got to look and we looked outside. Oh. There's a car right there. Gibson says that officers were on scene immediately after that crash. Drugged the door. He was like, boom, boom, boom. And then he got the guy and he was like, my leg, I can't feel my legs. Another one rolling around in cuffs like, I love you, bro. I love you. Louisville Metro Police said that the two juveniles were taken to Norton Children's Hospital with non-life threatening injuries. There's no word yet on what charges they could face. Crews were able to tow that car out of the hotel nearly 15 hours after that crash happened. Now, Doug, we have been uh, reaching out to officials for a little bit more information throughout the day. Clarksville police and uh, officials here at the hotel. We have not gotten any updates on the condition of either of the two juveniles involved. I did speak, though, uh, with one of the uh, mothers of one of those people. They said that her son did have a broken femur. He was going into surgery earlier today. Now, uh, Clarksville police did have some more information that they released as the day continued. Of course, we know that this stealing Kia's trend is now becoming very popular on TikTok, so we are going to be working to reach out and get more information. And when we do have anything else, we'll be sure to share it with you. Reporting in Louisville, Jim Stratman, WHAS 11 on your side.